<coughs> hello so in this session we will discuss on a target language or for the target machines so first we discuss about target machine model so target machine model <coughs> our target computer model is a three address machine with load and store operations computation operation jump operation and conditional jumps so means our uh, target machine model consists of three address machine code which involves load and store operations computation operation jump operation and conditional jumps most instructions consist of an operator means here is our instruction syntax we call it most instruction consist of an operator followed by target followed by list of source of operands so this is our own kind of syntax which we require for the generation of the machine instruction we assume the following kinds of instructions are available in our target machine one so as usual first is nothing but the load operation the instruction capital L D D S T colon address loads the value in the location address into location distance. Means actually the value which is present to address this A double D R we have to load into D S T variable here. And by using the load operation we perform. The most common form of the instruction is L D R colon X, which loads the value in location X into register R. An instruction of the form L D R Colon R2 is a register to register copy in which the contents of the register R2 are copied into register R2. So, this kind of instruction format is present into load operation. Second is the store operations. So, store operation the instruction form like st, st x colon R stores the value in register R into the location x. <coughs> Third kind of uh, instructions computation operations. So computation operation, the syntax like OP, OP is nothing but the operator, OP, DST, CRC1, CRC2, CRC is uh, we call it resources and DST is dist uh, destination, where OP is operator like addition, subtraction, etc. Distance means actually we have to store the result and sources one is sources to are the kind of the location also called the operator. For example, if we want to make a subtraction of the two uh, values and store the uh, third of them, so for that we require three register. Two register for the particular value for the two values, and the one register for the three. So subtraction are we going to do the distribution as we have to do the distribution. Third kind of the instruction we are telling for this central to branch to instruction branch to the machine instruction is the other one. We are using but a branch conditional values of the form D conditional R is our kind of instruction conditional things the form D conditional R from I where I will be registered and conditions is for any of the common test on when we use the register this condition we open with the condition for example B less than or equal to 0 L T Z is nothing but less than or equal to 0 R comma R colon L or this a jump to label L is it the value in the register less than zero and allows control to pass the instruction? No, not only this is the value that we pass our control to the instruction. The condition satisfies the integer condition. All the number to pass control to the next instruction. Next point of our target machine target machine model is nothing but addressing. In instructions, target machine has a variety of addresses. In instruction, the location can be variable name x referring to the main location that we will go for us. A location can also be an index form of the form where a is a variable and r is a register. First, we simple call the location for our register. It can be called the array form. 
So the memory location can be integer indexed by register. For example, the R1 from 100 R2 has the effect setting here to set the index for the R1. We also allow two indirect addressing modes. Indirect addressing mode will be the following. Star R means the memory location found in the location represented by the contents of register R. Means we have to use the indirect addressing. Then finally, we allow an immediate constant addressing mode. And the constant is prefixed by uh, hash value. The instruction will be R1 hash and then loads the integer and then into register R1 and add R1 from R1 hash and the integer and then register R1. And comments for each and every instruction will be preceded by the other step. The three address technique, for example, we will be for the address the key address technique which is supposed to by commander can be implemented by the machine instruction writers. We have to load y value into R1, we have to load z value into R2, then we have to make a subtraction R1, R1 comma R1 comma R2. These values we have to make subtractions to the residual to R1 and then we have to store that R1 residual to X. So this is the key address technique for this uh, operation. Likewise, the address instruction for our uh, array index, likewise this. Implement the address statement for indirect part, this is here. And for uh, making conditional, unconditional, so this code is here. This is x uh, less than 1, we have to shift label L. So this is our uh, condition. Instruction. Thank you.